They are all hands-on, all assets, all resources. Ooh. Simple spotted. Oh, he didn't see Hunter. He's going to sneak down. This could be massive. He's already on the move. But Hunter's coming back that direction, and Simple gets moved by a Glock. Yeah, but you can see the mindset of Simple on the hunt. Saw an opportunity. This one doesn't pan out. Neither does that. What a shot. Modesty, great level bring brought in in this pistol round. And it's just bit. Can the sophomore do anything? And he goes down as well. The pistol is going to go to G2. A bomb site is lost. Very, very concise as well. The accuracy, no question. Dooley's to find plenty of utility on Boomage as well if they can take away for the next round. That would be massive. He's going to be hunkered down. He finds one. Safety for Boomage. Perfecto as well. And G2 content with the victory. It's one to nothing. Let's see utility over. Spots the first. Waits it out. Simple strikes. He didn't see the second. He didn't see the second. He looked back. He was pumping the shotgun. That denied his vision. Jax gets underneath. And down goes Simple. Monacy and Hunter come in as well. And it's a pretty clean execution. You were right. He was in the right spot. Yeah. It was just the timing. It caught him off. And just buy up some easy utility around it. Three to nothing for G2. But the guns are about to come out for Navi. And Simple's got plenty of cash for an AWP comfortable situation for a defense to be in. Look at all the bodies towards CT spawn. They're trying to find this one lurker on rap site, but they've given up control of the bomb site in exchange. This is going to be tough, and modesty has got another. There's the peak. It's all on to Simple. Electronic finds the initial kill. What a great flick. Simple absolutely nails Alexi B, and you're right. They gave up the pit side, but they got the information on the re-peak from Finn as Boomich wraps back around. Jax is up high on the balcony, but he will fall down below, and it is all left to Nico. One on two, and he is the late lurk. Bomb still down on that side. Simple shut out by Smoke. They are uncertain of Nico's timing. The rifle versus Simple's AWP and Electronic to support. Electronic right now sitting in moto. Was this gun barrel spotted as he tried to peek out? Because Nico certainly thinks otherwise. See Simple down low, but he has arrived in the server now as he gets his third kill in the game. Second in the round of the AWP and Navi have their first. Should the bomb not arrive on the site sooner? No rotation yet from B. It's a five versus three on the take. And bit up close on the barrel. He's going to have to go big on this one. Swings out. Nose modesty was close. Had to rebolt. Alexi B trades, but that's a job very well done considering they lost electronic behind. Simple smoked off, though. Boomich is there to support this as Jax will hold in the corner. That's a tough position to clear. Walking out as well with the AWP. If he takes one shot toward the site and no one is there, Jax will be able to swing it in. Simple instead, it goes the other way. He gets the advantage of information, but still such a tough task. And do they consider going for this in a two-on-two? -two? Surely, but now to. they have to. Exactly that. Simple go over the top. Does he try and go over the cart? They'll nade out knowing it's going to walk by. Hunter's looking for a better Done. angle. He's looking for better vision. And you're right, the timing is gone. And more importantly, Simple's going to be caught out. He can't escape. The AWP goes down, and it's a disaster for Navi. They do lose Hunter and Alexi B to the bomb. It is worth noting that all five players die for G2, but it's 6-1 to one in their favor. What's up, guys? Check out HotPizza.gg, a really good kiss opening website. Recently, Hot Pizza has added really cool new operational cases. For example, in this new case, you can get a special rare item which guarantees you 100% profit. Also, they are holding a new event as well. First, select your preferred payment method, and for every $1 deposited, you get one bomb. Once you get 100 of them, you can open a new operational case for free and get a nice bonus item. Also, don't forget to use my code METS to get 50 cents for free and start opening more cases. The website has many other modes like case openings, case battles, and case upgrades. Link to the website is in the description below. And the retake forced away. Here we go, simple. Run boost. Oh, oh, baby, he wants to get aggressive. He's got it. Absolutely what you'd expect to see from Simple on this stage. I said he was going to be aggressive. He's playing with a motivation right now to stand above, but finding Jax up close. He wasn't quite ready for it. Bit does get the trade, so it will still be a sustained advantage for Navi. Flashbang shown for Rapside. They're going to move in. Monacy couldn't find anything. No mistakes given by Navi. Here's the hit, but the crossfire oh so strong. Monacy misses a chance. Down to 10 HP, and he's going to fall at the end. Double kill for Bit in the round. He just cures the AWP for Simple in the next. Navi just four rounds back. Which to bags. Late smoke to cover off Nico. Perfecto and Simple are on the charge because it's a close bracket to hold on the opposing side of the map. But it's Alexi B with a MAC-10 that wins out the first kill. Monacy's ready for the re-aggression from Bit. Down he goes. It's got to be the arrival of the rotation and Perfecto on the spot in the perfect time. We'll take out Alexi B. And that'll slow things, but temporarily so. Hunter's already inside of the pit, but nothing to deter the vision. Simple, I thought he was going to get a second shot at it. Goes back out. Can't quite collect the head that time, but it'll work and wrap around Monacy, not with his shepherd staff, but he will still be able to convey and persuade 
Only for a single kill as Hunter holds the bomb is planted in the process. Down slash potentially for Hunter. Off the door. Hop out into the lane. Forces them to look away. Boom is fully blind. Nico goes on that. What a call between the Kovacs. And now Simple's traps. A recovery 7 2 off the back of the timeout. Have their full resources here. Molotov and flashbangs to delay. And Alexei wants nothing to do with it. Hunter takes out bit. Not done there. He finds Electronic trying to refrag toward top middle. He'll wrap around as well. So much control. Simple will shut him down. But it's still not a sit in stone situation as he is left alone. Simple again. Out in the lane as well. He's going to be caught. Nico late on this could trail over and protect Alexi B, who still holds the bomb, still holds the MAC 10. Simple making noise. I don't know if he's hurt at that position. No, he wasn't quite. But Nico certainly gets away with it as Simple can't land the shot. He had to do something. He had to do something. He knows what the play is with one AWP at the eight bomb site. He knows G2 likely to wrap through halls, make it really, really difficult for the AWP to get a multi kill. He had to secure one of his fronts, not being pinched. Imagine so, but right now he's probably pretty comfortable about things. It was so close, that shot from Simple. It would have been real interesting to see what he could have made of the round afterwards. Another clean round for G2. Facto tag down to three. If he's able to call that hit, watch for Utility to take him down and finish him off inside of the site. With, as well, the crossfire completely. Smoke Boomage has to walk through. Nico has him instead, and it's three to hold the site alone. Perfecto once more is in such a tough position. He's managed to get away from Orange's one and two. Goes to water instead, but Alexi B able to land on his feet and turn back to find him. It will give Bit the chance, as we mentioned. The closest to rotation, but he is removed by Monacy once more and simple. He better strike with absolute perfection now. AK-47, he's spotted in the smoke, and this one is over as well. Double digits already, G2. Yeah, and th this is just a round that has built up all the successes they've had in Banana. Maybe not at their best, so keep that in the back of your mind. 10 to 2. It's working out, as you mentioned, exactly the way Nico said it in the interviews. See if they can use it this round. Simple again, he gets down toward Hunty. Hunter. Excuse me, at the bottom side of the middle as Nico has to work out. Molotov's on his feet. They've definitely heard him close this time, and they've got a position set for it. Once again, though, the man has been struggling for kills. Boomich will strike. Something off the back of the timeout. The energy, perhaps beneficial as Alexi B left in middle. Jax and Monacy with him. Monacy with the AWP still looking for a pick in response, but... New box, Molotov down. Flash for Monacy, he's in. Simple, he strikes back through the smoke. His calls for solidarity, and now his teammates will step up as it's companionship toward the championship. That's the goal for Na'Vi in this round. Everyone strikes, and it's just Alexi B left. It'll have to fade away. Nine seconds left in the round, and he's gonna be caught. He's gonna be taken down. It should be before time, but it is a third for Na'Vi. Not quite yet. A little bit of indecision almost it seemed, but Simple's given the utility to Boomich. He wants to play with the gun. He wants to do the dirty work himself, and he'll start it off with Alexi B's head being removed. Boomich will now step out as they swing wide and try and compensate for the emo position, and Simple flashes himself back into contention. So instead of trying to fire back close range with the AWP, he repositions, gives Jax information. Boomich survives and stays alive. Good pre-fire attempt from Jax. Good read, but Simple's going off. He's got two more. He'll swing it around and perfect those three in a row. Now we're starting to see them come alive. This is the energy that Na'Vi exactly needs. Positivity on the stage. In front of the fountain has no one that's actually holding the top side of Banana, so they're stuck in the site. They didn't even try and slow this retake down by putting a forward stance on that, despite the information that was attained. And you were right, they had to go on it. And now they have to hold predictable position. Simple's already removed. Perfecto, good for one. Bit's gonna chime in as well. He'll get taken down in the end, but Bit back towards CT. Trying to bait Boomage back into position as well as they're both holding off on the same angle. Nothing to cover the bomb yet, but it's not planted for them. They can go in behind the fountain. It's the wrong guy. He's it's not the diffuser. It's not the diffuser, but Bit's got the kill instead. And Na'Vi get the round. What a gutsy win from Na'Vi. They had every disadvantage in that round. Usually that retake in Banana is not that quick after the plant. But G2 is there and ready to fight immediately. Simple wants to investigate. Clean and concise with the AK. Bit again, not finding enough. He's going to rotate back. This is the full stack. They see the first. Boomich tagged. They haven't got the shots in return. And it's falling apart. Now the crossfire problem. Bomb is down on the deck. 28 seconds. It's not so much the time that matters. It's the positioning. They can't get the kills back. Jumping over, running, gunning. Perfecto's only good for one, but Simple spinning around finds two. And it's he that has to clutch it back. He needs to win it. This out with 17 seconds. Jack's back towards CT as well. If he doesn't get Alexi B fast enough, he won't have time to go for the plan. Now he knows he does. Now he knows he can put this down. Holding, baiting Jax, though. If he goes to try and counter this off, oh, oh, Simple. Has he done too much? Has he complicated things? Has he gone away? Oh, no. HP. He's going to move forward. It's no, he didn't get it. He didn't get it down. No way. 
Jax is going to win out the round on time alone. Simple best leaving it to his name goes too complicated in the end. Ooh, this could be huge. The A1S as well, even if it's through the edge of smoke, it'll be confusing for them. He has to back off because he's blinded up, does sufficient damage, takes bit back down to eight. But combined, Perfecto and he will find the kill. Now they need to find Nico. The back of the site finally taken down. Boomich on 100. He'll go for the bomb plant this time with 12 seconds and stick it all the way to the deck. He wants to go to the AK instead, but they'll know that he's naturally gone into that corner. One versus two for the in-game leader of Mavi. Flash outs. Quick peek on the back of it. Sees no one toward the top side of Banana Monas. He's still staring at He's gone. Spotted up, though. Dink, he knows Hunter's lurking. He knows Hunter's swinging, but Hunter has the headshot instead. What a tough clutch. G2 playing it so well. I dare say Dust 2 might be required at the rate we're going, because I can't imagine these two teams settle this without a brawl to the finish as Nico does early damage onto Perfecto. He's tagged down to 13. They'll try and capitalize, and they will with an eight. Alexi B, but back it comes Simple through the smoke. Jax holding onto the pit. Electronic can't find the return shot. And the Molotov, rather incendiary, if we want to get technical, will push him away, force him back down the hall. So we sit still for a moment. Not for long. Nade strike will oh, no. do damage onto Navi. That's a nightmare. This gap is so huge. Hunter's going to get a free kill. Might even be able to get two. Simple's able to respond, but Modesty's there for the trade immediately. G2 on top again by six rounds, 13 to 7. Towards the wrap side we go, it's going to be Monacy in spawn with the op to check the cross. Not able to grab the first, wants the second, he legs him. Alexi B now activated, and he's going to have a couple of free kills. HP is so low for Navi, and this round is just going to drift away. As it was meant to from the G2 perspective. Good kill on Monacy, but I don't think that opens anything meaningful up. They could get a plant towards the A-bomb site if Perfecto can find this kill, and he does! And maybe now it gets interesting. It's gonna be a race. Hunter's already going that direction. They're uncertain. He steps back. That might let Perfecto cross, but no utility to do Time. so. He, you're right. It's only three seconds. He can't get the bomb down. It is over. They'll at least collect weapons on the back of that. G2 wants to go for a retake. It looks like setting up for the flashbang. Here it comes. Nico's going to swing first. Anthe flash. Good shot from Simple. The timing on it's perfect. The shot. Modesty can't get away. They're too dedicated to the retake. And Navi, you've got to know what a massive advantage you have at this B bomb site. Ignore that smoke. Boomage coming through, and he's got Alexi. Sight cracked open. An eighth round is on the cards. Unless Hunter can do something special, but he's backing away already. Yeah, that's just desperation from Hunter. That's just trying to find one where you can, and none other than Simple to fall, but they'll easily grab his gun off. Off the floor. That was a preemptive shot inside of that flashbang. Nico went around the corner. Simple was blind. So they put the wall of smokes. They actually just want to isolate them entirely. One as well on the balcony. That's going to give them no vision, but they still have to get inside of the site. And Hunter's the third in this picture. Nico, the fourth. This is not clear cut. This is still dangerous. This is Navi again going toward a stack, and it's been completely removed. Absolutely obliterated. It is now overtime and match point for G2. Oh, my heart bleeds for Navi. That collapsed so quick. Close range AWP, Simple's no stranger to it. One flash, one smoke for Navi for the rest of the round. And again, it's four players on this side. One for one so far. Alexi B's left alone, but it's Monacy that steps back out. Bit get Hunter. He's found a third in this round as well. Simple finally gets Nico down. But he's aware he has bomb, and he's going to go. He's going to go toward the site because Bit's already cleared it, so they have the advantage as Alexi has to rotate. So they'll keep this one alive a little longer. Simple's op stays very much alive. He's at the top side of mid for Navi. Oh, Monacy. Around the corner, he's getting aggressive. Oh, flashed off, good flick over. Jax has protected him from behind. He's got another. Wheeling back into the bomb site, and that's the knockout punch. Five on two, and Alexi's covering the flank. Oh, there is no joy in this round for Navi. Be clear from the apartments as he goes up toward alt middle. The try and boost is simple. No shot success on the first attempt toward the pit. He'll head toward the lane. Tough position. Hunter gets above. It's all onto him. A one on five, and he's not going to get the first. Jax closes it out. Monacy starts it. Jax closes it, and it's one nothing G2 in the series. Just so many rounds for G2 to play with in that second half. you got to give credit to the phenomenal calling, the phenomenal game plan on the offensive side of Inferno. Gave G2 such a lead to toy with. And off the hop on Navi's map choice, the A side is certainly going to get the attention early. No utility thrown yet, but there's going to be a forward stance, Jax. And Nico bit removing. 
second game in a row that the Glock has opened with a headshot before the USP, but Nico's able to slide back, gets all the way into the shadow position, unaware, however, Simple has come over the top, Bit gets the kill instead, there was no support, as the smoke goes down toward the top side of Connector as well, it's just Hunter that has vision, Monacy wants to get up above, he's done so, but he's taken down again by none other than Bit, who's coming alive, he's got four in this, he can start it off with an ace, we talked about a sophomore slump, well, how about a sudden turnaround, and him stepping up would give Simple so much space, as he swings as well, boom, and he'll start it off with all five for Navi. That's beautiful. What a way to get it started. A powerful pissed around from Bit. And the other aspect of the last game, you mentioned it just as we were walking off, Jason, in private, but Boomich was baffled early. He was getting bruised, yeah. he was getting beaten, he was getting beat at B, and he's the in-game leader. He was a little bit late on his calls, and you mentioned that might have knocked him out of his mentality. He needs to start. He'll go, it's Boomich only inside of the middle. No one peeking him yet. Hunter can swing window, Nico has vision through connector, so he's not uh -oh. free right in passage, they didn't see Alexi B! But it's Pit again with the sixth kill in this game, the only one so far to frag for Navi. Now Boomich turns it around, good play up on top of the fence, leaves him out of range and out of sight from connector, but Monacy coming in with the scout will finish off with Nico started. In the meantime, however, bomb has been planted. For the first of the defenders, Bit needs to be so careful with oh, time. He looked away, but he turns back, realizes the window is wide open and no one occupying his space. <laughs> this guy is just absolutely on a fire to start off this map, exactly what they need. Yeah, definitely. Bit is showing up in a huge, huge way. This is great. Eight kills so far. Is he going to grab a ninth? Jax knows he's cut off from any kind of retreat. Simple is going to find him. You're exactly on it. What a great start for Bit in the game. The vision above the smoke, which makes it a little bit more comfortable for Bit to get inside. Yeah, but they don't like the fact that they've lost mid control. They don't like the fact they don't have a whole lot of information. Good kill from Honesty. That's the office. Boom, it jumps up into the window. Huge Molotov delay. Simple's coming through. He, he don't care at all. Nico inside of the bomb site. There's some space for him to work with, but not for long. And now Modesty arrives. Got the first one. Electronic found. Simple tagged so low, but Hunter's looked away at the wrong time. No, he's got back. He swings around and takes down Simple. Just to note. But now, they've shuffled so many players actually away from the point of attack. Oh no, they consider it, they come back. Hunter, big job to do, he's got the first. Electronic is gonna try and keep him pinned down, dropping to the floor, it's simple to get the kill, but Nico's here as well. That's so much gain, gain ground from Hunter, he slows them enough that Nico can easily sneak back into the site. He was gone, he was already through checker. Halfway toward the murder hole, trying to sneak it to the A site, but time is of the essence. 14 seconds, he spots the backside of Boomich, knowing he's wrapping, sees the shadow, and there has to be a second one up close, baits the shot from Simple, but he's not done there, he goes back down for a no scope, six seconds the time, but it's not enough on the angle as Alexi B rotates in and it's going to be G2 stealing back the round. That allows Boomich to cross to the boxes for free, Nico. Smoke below his feet, flames behind him. He's going to try and go battle with Bits. This is two big men trying oh, to no. for position, but how was the switch from Nico? What an adaptation, realizing the Boomage wanted middle. He'll take it back by just changing the angle. MP7 works perfectly for Alexi B, but he'll burn alive immediately after Monacy catching simple, jumping across. Nico strikes in middle, round slowly expiring. Electronic left without the bomb. He's gonna go back above just to get that, and Monacy's gonna make that next to impossible. He's down to one HP, mind you, as Electronic gets a Timed spray toward the door. Thought that was a chance to go across, but he's gonna go for kills instead. 31 seconds. They're all closing in on his position, and it's Hunter instead that takes the kill. It was still gonna be kind of a weak initial attack at the A bomb site for Navi. Now it's even weaker. Nico with the information, but look at him. He knows. He considers the underpass play. Bit can't find it. Huge opportunity missed for Navi. And the hit is shut down before it begins. If it has slowed down, Boomich running one already. Perfecto, though, does strike to get Jax. That means Hunter's locked. They don't know it yet, but they've actually got no one towards CT to defend this take of the site, and Hunter's distracted. They need to cross over soon. Simple will leave the charge on it. Boomich lost, however. Means Connector's an open possibility, and Hunter wins that duel as well. As Simple had the upper hand, is Perfecto to get a shot. AWP to play it. And he doesn't know that Nico's up close. Couldn't spot the nade thrown first. And above he goes to make it now the sixth round. A good amount of noise, but no one really that close to it as of yet. Bomb waiting for Bit, they'll rotate around, and this looks like Perfecto posturing. If you can get a like CB down on the inside of that smoke, that's an AK up for grabs. Good find from Hunter, spot simple boosting above. And Alex CB knows there's gonna be a take on this. He's ready for the counter play, and in comes the MAC-10. Nico striking immediately, does knock Electronic back down, but they have the AK oh. still in play, four HP, mind you. As it's a make no mistake, Boomich. Time, 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 time. Say, Nico, you're right, six seconds, crossing over, they're not there, oh, just barely, just barely in time, they'll get this bomb plant down, Boomich, Tech 9 in position, but now comes Jax, he was so good previously in this tournament, hasn't done a ton in terms of impact in this game so far, hasn't needed to, to be fair, but Boomich definitely does, mentioned his opening, oh, this time he's got a lineup, 
He's got one on the M4 already. Modest. Oh, he's done it. And Bumich is back. Bumich is going to make a huge impact now. Navi find four. God, did they need him. What a brilliant round of clutch for Bumich. First since round two when he had eight. Still tops the charts. That's how impressive his start was, but he definitely needs to get his momentum back in this game. Simple's going to take out Jax. It's a trade for the cost of Perfecto. Monacy was in good position to try and strike toward the palace. Navi, they think they have the room to reset. They do not. They do not. But Simple is always on top of it. One step ahead, he catches out Alexi B. And it's because they have the site by which Alexi had vacated. If Monty's can hit this shot, that would be incredible. That would be everything. Oh, just an arrow miss. But he knows where they're headed. Bit holding on, and he's got Hunter. How much does Monacy want to dedicate his life to this bomb site? Monacy. On catwalk, finds the timing. Eight seconds. If he can drop the bomb, it'd be everything. But it travels into the site. One on two for Modesty now. It's sacrificial. Gives his position away. He wants Modesty's end goal. But this man, oh, the shepherd staff takes down the goat. And he takes Simple out of the round to give it to G2. Unbelievable to find all three. How fast is this guy? Ridiculous! Put this in slow mo. Oh. A rousing chant from the crowd, and why not? We wondered what the ceiling was of the city. Even Alexi can't believe it. Even Alexi just puts his hands up, and he's like, "All right, whatever." Shot Monacy again. He's not alone in this position. He could be. Just leave him there. This, this kid doesn't need a babysitter. Well, that one's actually, that, there's obviously some skill, but that one's intelligence. He knows the second player, if the op shows there, the most likely position is another rifle to keep space. So he knows the second player is going to be looking for his teammate, takes advantage of it. I think that clutch from Modesty might have knocked Navi out of his half. They are dropping everything. No fight going this way, or going their way. Not done yet, Jason. All right. Gonna keep adding some stats to this <laughs> bit as well. Closing out the round, another multi at four in this round. Perfecto setting the supports. Boost behind the fence this time, Spa. Yeah, that, is he full blind or not? I was gonna say, I don't think he was, but either way, Simple sees it. That's a, not a bad play, not a bad setup. It counters out the stack perfectly because they didn't want to give away position and try and go for the direct, direct boost behind the smoke. Instead, though, Navi get both. Hunter can do what he wants with the flames, but he's already outnumbered at this point in time. It's Simple has gone beyond the Lexi B. That'll take back a bit of space, and Bit's gonna be careful. This is a corridor. This is a tunnel. Smoke not able to be spotted inside of it. Oh, this is an issue. Massive advantage in the round for Navi with the two opening kills, and they're not gonna get anything else after it for the moment. Electronic's the only play they have to win this round. Hunter looking behind at the moment, but Electronic needs to provide the opening, and ooh, gap in that smoke. That'll be frustrating. No way for Electronic to know. No way for him to even react. It's gonna try and barge his way in with the bomb, but no chance at all. No need to get been on the A main position with Electronic still inside of Palace Perfecto. Rotating it off though, he's walked his way back over there right there. So because Jax is waiting, we'll see again. We'll find Boomich. The bomb temporarily, Nico. Doesn't have to worry yet about Bit. Bit wants to pinch this. He wants to try and make the play to hold off. The CTs, but why? The AWP is so scary. I don't want to walk up those stairs. Monacy's a monster. Hunter and Nico getting kills. Perfecto only good for one. And if he dare step any further, he go down. Hunter will take him out instead. It's 11-4 at the half in favor of G2, who might go G2. Oh, we've got very little left in this, or is Navi? In the first half, it shattered anything that they were going to be able to do. Navi again in a tough position heading into the second half. Smoke comes out towards jungle. Hunter's gonna wait for the plume. A little bit early, but it doesn't matter. Simple close up gets one. Boomich gonna have to survive and fall back. And again, bit with another pistol round headshot. Absolutely. He's six between the two pistols now. Electronic with doubling in this round is gonna try and hold off now as they wrap in. It's Nico. Ooh, sandwich. But from above, Perfecto gets to him before he can be more punishing. Haven't found any of those picks that they would have liked. Boomich gonna be forced back a little bit. He's gotta be careful. Electronics attention is now split. Simple, gonna hold the line with the USP. Great headshots. A fourth added on to it. Let that man go for the ace. Boomich will clean it up at the end. And Simple shrugs it off. G2 is running out of options and Simple's being put into play, but he didn't spot the player in window. This is huge. Doesn't matter. He's got the free kill toward the bomb. He might get turned around on by Hunter. Still didn't see him, I don't think. 
Hunter. Hunter was in it and out just as quickly as the vision was gained. It is lost, so to the site. Electronic aware well as well that these Lel lost the front side that they've given up A. Bombs down. Bombs down a connector. There's only 10 seconds of the clock. Jackson's just got it now. He's got a plant. Simple goes down. Hunter has been effective and somehow Perfecto can't complete the kill. He has to as well, but there's flames at the feet of both. They can't battle. They have to hold positions. This is my time for G2. Jack sits on the side. Good shot back from Electronic. That'll close it out. They'll get the defuse, but that was tantalizingly close to disaster. That was way too close to disaster if you're Navi. He's the only one really defending this beat bombsite. Bit has just arrived. It has gotten there just in time, but Hunter's sneaking up, and I think Perfecto's preoccupied. Knowing that he was the only one there, no one's even considered the possibility of Bit. He's in a tough position because they'll be able to wrap and swing, but he seemingly has shown up again. He's gonna hold his nerve once more, but they are swinging still. Nico on the AK, gets the re-peak as well. They tried to swing it back, had to play the right side peak as he was close to the pillar, but Simple sneaking with the AWP. Bomb goes down, he's not down, he's gonna work his way in, and Boomich has the angle in the position, he gets both instead. Simple never needs to strike, but we've got a tie game. Yeah, it wasn't just that, but Simple's arrival allows Bit to address different parts of the map. Simple gets there and he says, I've got the angle for market, no one's wrapping upon you, don't worry. He's gonna come right back for the fight. Simple has gotta make himself as small a target as possible. Flashbang is out. Hunter is so dedicated and he's got it. He's rewarded. And a two-man lead again in the round. Perfecto to hold the line. I think Simple was hoping the longer he stayed, the sooner that Hunter would have figured he'd already left the position, but he gets caught in the last second with the pistol. Perfecto, however, is holding the line. Boomich and Bit. Bit's on the flank. There's no one coming from Mark. There's no one coming from the checkers position. Hunter taking out Perfecto. Bit's a little bit late, a little bit tardy on the position in the take, as the smoke down is also going to make things more difficult. But Nico is well aware that there's likely going to be someone arriving soon. He'll take him out, and it's all on to Boomich. One versus two. Big man's got moves. Gonna try and go for the jump, no mistake on it, and he gets up to catwalk instead. Jumps further forward before he's heard. Honestly, he's not yet aware of this. He's gonna go for the bomb plant back, expose Nico's low. Boomich has clutched one back already in this game. Starts it off well. Nico's the one that killed Simple. Surely he has to be aware that he was up toward the oh! position, and he certainly is. Calm, composed, and Boomich will make it 12-12. You gotta give a shout out to Boomich from the first map that he had. Such a tough map on Inferno. That's why they're nading and they're putting everything toward that window position to make Electronic have to reconsider and relocate. That also means Nico thinks he's clear to go because they know he's pushed back, but they didn't know about Bit. It does not matter if Alexi Beacon in the shots instead. Perfecto. I'm up to the name, my friends. Gonna have to. No, he's gone. Bonus, he's already got him as well as Jax coming down. Electronic removed. Boomich. He might have the big brain, but this time I don't think he's got any chance of using it against four players. He's gonna have to hold on to the AK-47. And once again, Navi get close money as well for the Navi side, but I think this might be the final buy. G2 are going to have him at a really strong position. Sudden strike will come. Boomich backside of the ticket booth. No smoke in front of him just yet, but he can see the ones on top of the stairs. Alexi B trying to jump in. It's Monacy that protects him as he baits it out, going for the bog plant. Fast mechanics, but fast to get in position. Simple rotates around. He now looks toward the palace. Bomb down on the deck, and it would try to be recovered by Hunter. That gives Bit the angle through the box. Oh, strikes again, and it's Monacy. He takes down. It might be enough to win out the rounds. From this event, as Jax slides forward once more to try and recover the ball. Gets the shot on Bit! Oh, he had the angle on Perfecto, but down he goes, and it's all on to Nico. And we've said it, we have not used his name often in these clutch situations in this game. With four seconds left, it had to be killed, but it's Perfecto that gets it instead. Very important round for both teams. Electronic gonna try and flash Boomich in from far. They're already up close. He's the fully blind. That flash was too late. Hunter gets the kill instead, and Electronic, they now know he is towards CT, so the smoke close. Jax wants to hold off on the wall, and once again, Navi does all the work to tie the game, but not enough to win it back unless Electronic can get an angle. He and Bit converge, and just like that, they steal position in the round. Ball not yet planted, but Nico forward catches out Electronic, and Bit gave position away inside of the site. He had to go back in behind ticket. No smoke down. Modesty's able to see through. He's not done there. Let's praise the calling from G2 one more time. He'll get Perfecto to work with, but even then, Alexi B is able to trade and swing. It's a three-man take from the connector. Not with Bonacy still in it. Jax wins the first tool. Perfecto doesn't even swing fast enough. Deagle in hand. They pretty much have to concede play for overtime point if they don't get the next pick. But Electronic going in. Alexi B, that'll give position and information. Shadow shows. Jax holds, and Boomich will back away. Oh, that's so brutal. I say he's gonna back away, he hasn't gone yet. Doesn't have a kit, so you'd suspect he's just trying to make economic impact here. Try and take the guns down, here's the AWP, but this is gonna be mapping series point for G2. 
And nothing to fight with. Bit and Perfecto rotating through spawn. Electronic standing his ground with an MP9. Bits only the Deagle. This is gonna have to be perfect. Starts off very well. Trying to counter the peak out. Hunter though holds it and they both go down. Couldn't get a second simple though. He'll come back out to get Monacy down, and he's not done there as he rotates over the MP7 to work with. Spraying and praying at this point. Praying quite literally that he finds one kill through it. Jackson's on one HP. Would have been a great target to find, but Hunter will get the bomb in position instead. That one HP still might be a factor as he nearly swung out. Nice shot for Fecto. He's giving them a chance. Nico has to reload. Simple's got an AK pick. No! It's the headshot instead! And Navi removed, erased, and it's G2 Well, what an incredible show from G2. Modesty with some flashes of brilliance.